Hello. Good morning. <sighs> Today is a minimum day, which is always a good day because the classes are short. Uh, let's see if I can reach. I can't reach. There it is. Hang on. Hang on. Wait. Got it. Okay. In music appreciation for the next two days. It'll it'll have to be two and a half days because uh, it'll have to be Friday after they finish the test also. But we're watching Carousel. Carousel, Rodgers and Hammerstein's uh, arguably finest work. I think Oklahoma is really, really good. But uh, Carousel is also good. And this is the featured example in chapter 19 of our textbook talking about musical theater and how music adds emotion and depth to characters on stage. It's uh, the original play was called Lilium from 1902, I think it was. Rogers and Hammerstein. Hammerstein wrote the libretto. <coughs> and uh, their Broadway debut of Carousel was in 1945, the last year of World War II. And um, the movie came out in, I think it was 56. Shirley Jones, so cute, such a cutie. I'll tell you, if I had been a boy in 1956, I would have had such a crush on her. I knew her as Shirley Partridge from the Partridge family. By the way, that's the extra credit question on our test Friday. Um, not that I had a crush on her, but that um, she would go on to be a mom in a TV show about a family rock band. Anyway, uh, so I don't know. I hope we have time to watch the whole thing. I got it used. So can you read that? Used. Very good. So it better play on my DVD player in my classroom. Actually, I have a Blu-ray player in my classroom. I got it for 20 bucks. $20 at a thrift stop, thrift store, Goodwill or Salvation Army, one of those. I said, this is a Blu-ray player for 20, why is this 20 bucks a Blu-ray player? They said, well, it works, we plug it in, it works. It doesn't have a remote. That's okay, I'll buy a remote online. Pardon me while I merge between these two trucks on the freeway. All right, so it's a minimum day. Movie time and music appreciation. And we'll see you later. We'll check in later on. I had a great day today, easy day. <coughs> <coughs> this nagging cough, gosh, dang it. I gotta get a haircut, my wife is right. I have to get a haircut. I was gonna go, see if I could go all year without getting a haircut. Because I had such a severe haircut right before school started. And I thought, oh, I wanna have to get my haircut all year because it was so dang short. But yeah, I'm gonna have to get it cut. Ding, missed it. Uh, had a great day. Showed the first 43 minutes of Carousel to my music appreciation classes. Band went well. Seventh period was sectionals. I ducked out of the sectionals for a bit to attend uh, 
the staff potluck. It was a crock pot luck, crock pot potluck. My dear wife, who is always so supportive of these things, um, made chili. That's what I had. I had my wife's own chili, my own wife's chili. That was my selection because I knew it would not have any onions in it. Thank you very much. I don't like onions. Um, it was a minimum day, so we got done. The uh, drumline practiced after school today for a bit, about an hour or so. And it's now 4.01, and I am headed to my chiropractor, whom I have not seen since November, early December. I don't remember the last time I was in. I should go once a month, but I thought I would try to go two months. But there are days when I wish I could go every day. And what's great is he has a masseuse in-house. And so I go see her at 4.30 for half an hour. Just wonderful. Oh my goodness sakes. If I didn't know massages were so wonderful, I would have been doing them 20 years ago or more. Oh my goodness, just wonder, just a half hour. Just oh, so nice. And then I go straight from there to the chiropractor. So I'm nice and loose and relaxed. And then he can do his adjustments. Snap, crackle, and pop. So that's where I'm headed now. If I don't add anything more to this band director's log today, let me just remind you to subscribe like and share we're building a following I think we're up to 49 subscribers now I want to get up to 100 by the end of the school year so tell all your friends and I've noticed that uh, some people are watching but not subscribing and uh, not leaving comments leave me a comment say something nice like yeah you do need to get a haircut that'd be great you're looking really shaggy, dude. So, you know, something like that. All right. See you tomorrow.